if you guys want to see what Disneyland in 2021 looks like, come with us. We're going to show you everything. All right, you guys, we just did the check-in. They do do temperature checks. You have to be wearing a mask if you're three years old or older. And so they're gonna be checking that. We parked and it cost $25. The preferred parking was $40, but uh, it wasn't running right now since the trams are not running. So be advised of that. Now it's time to walk all the way down. We are going to Disneyland today versus California Adventure. We got 25% capacity. We're gonna see how the line's looking, okay? So let's get started. to go inside of Disneyland after so long of waiting and it feels so just amazing. And we are in, people, we are in just like that. We are here after the pandemic and the plan is to show you guys what's different from before, what 25% capacity looks like, give you guys tips along the way. That way you guys can prepare when you guys come on your journey to Disneyland. Guys, we got Pluto, we got Mickey, Minnie, and Goofy all behind me right here. They are still social distance, so you can't take a picture with them directly, but you guys can see them, and the kids love seeing them. It looks like all the stores here on Main Street are open and it looks like there's no line outside besides Starbucks in the morning. Uh, other than that, there's no line to get in any of the stores right here on Main Street. You guys, I have to inform you that Jungle Cruise is not running right now. I was kind of disappointed. This is the ones that I really like. I like the dad jokes that they give out, but it's closed right now. Indiana Jones Adventure is open, but uh, I might have to do this one solo. So if there's enough time, I'll come back and do this one. Unfortunately, guys, you guys are gonna find out that there's a lot of rides that they're not open. And one of them is Astro Blasters. All right, you guys, I've been giving you a lot of bad news, which ones are closed, but Star Tours is definitely open. They even have the Fast Pass. So I did want to let you guys know if you're on the app, you can still get Fast Pass even after the reopening. You guys, I got a little bit of bad news. Pizza Planet right behind me. It is not in service right now. Uh, we love eating pizza here, but it was closed, so we didn't get a chance to eat here. But Space Mountain, good news is Space Mountain is open for business. That's the cool thing. I don't know if I'm gonna have a chance to go in there, but uh, it's only 25 minute wait right now. So at 25%, you got a 25 minute wait. For those car enthusiasts, Autotopia is open for business. Make sure you guys have the Disneyland app downloaded because you can't have to order through the app if you guys want to eat anything while you're here. We are at the Red Rose Tavern right now and uh, we're actually trying to order a hamburger and let's see what else we're gonna get. So our food is ready, but just like a tip for you guys. So in like rush hour or lunch time, it's gonna take like more than an hour maybe to get your lunch ready. So order in advance and it's through your app they're doing the contact list so it's through your app they accept uh, apple pay or your card in your phone and well yeah we order pizza and a hamburger and it looks delicious there's no line whatsoever for the pinocchio ride so we better get on guys i got the matterhorn right here behind me unfortunately it's closed i say this is the biggest ride here in disneyland 
that's closed. They even have the front, everything's blocked off. You can't even get in there. So, you know, if you guys are looking forward to coming here and riding on the Matterhorn, it's not open. Sorry, you guys. It's a small world is open so they're doing like families in the center of the boat and then uh if you're a party of two they're gonna put two people all the way in the front of the boat and then two people all the way in the back of the boat that's not along with your party so that's how they're doing things around here So it's the same thing here in Toontown. You can't take a picture with Mickey, but you know, you can stand at the fence right there and he can take a picture in the background. As you guys could see behind me, they have a big building going on. It's gonna be a new ride. I think it's called Minnie and Mickey's Runaway Roller. Do not quote me on that. I try to remember what the lady told me, but it is a new ride that they got going on here in Toontown. And now we're gonna head into Roger Rabbit, still open. So we're gonna go check that out. And the line is not that long. It says it's a five minute wait time. So let's go check that out. I wanna let you guys that Peter Pan, which is right behind me, and also Snow White, which is now behind me, are both open and the line starts in front of the castle. You're gonna see a line, you're gonna go, what is that about? And that's for both of these rides right here. It does look long, but the thing is, all the line has to be outside. As soon as you get inside, there's no line. So the line outside is, is gonna be it. It's not gonna be like a whole nother line inside. That was a nice little 15 minute cruise. Now let's see what else we can get into. I am glad to tell you guys that the Pirates of the Caribbean is open. This is probably one of my favorite rides here at Disneyland. So it is a must for us. I'm also happy to tell you guys that the Haunted Mansion is open. The line forms up only right outside, so they don't let anybody wait inside. So as soon as the inside clears out, they start letting people in. You guys, Splash Mountain is open. I usually don't like getting on this ride because I don't want to be all with my clothes wet walking around Disneyland, but it is open for those who want to get in. guys we're in star wars land now and the most important thing that is open is right behind me it's the millennium falcon that ride is good to go so you guys that i'm bringing you guys good news and also they have the restaurant that's in the middle it's also open stores are open and it looks like everything is pretty much open here so you guys are in luck if you guys are coming to star wars land if you guys want to make a custom lifesaver that is very expensive they are open for business as well So the park does close at seven, but a little tip is the stores on Main Street, they close a little bit later, I was told eight o'clock. And so definitely, uh, you know, take advantage of that last hour and go shopping that last hour. Hope you guys like coming with us to Disneyland. Don't forget to hit that like button and see you guys on the next video. If you guys have any questions about today, just go ahead and put them down in the comment box.